Hello, everybody. Yay, everybody. <laughs> it's Friday. It's <laughs> Oh my gosh, this is so much fun. I, uh, we're super excited. We get all jazzed up and just giddy as little schoolgirls because it's Friday and we get to spend our day with you. This is this is the best day of the week. It truly is. By uh, far. If, yep. Yeah, it really is. If if you don't know who we are uh, by now, for shame, for shame. Anyway, uh, I'm Patty Quinn. I'm here with the amazing Hillary Buholtz. Hello, everybody. <laughs> and we are the co-founders of We Heart Hounds. Um, Fridays is our best day because we get to do all kinds of things in love of pups, whether they be crafts or recipes or just kind of having fun, getting together, doing some silly things, um, all in the name of our lovely fluff, fluffy floofs. Um, <laughs> and today <laughs> we're going to be doing a, an easy peasy dog tea. This, I don't think, I think we try to outdo each each. Yep craft as how easy and simple we can get. This one is probably, I would say the simplest one we've, we've ever done. Um, but it was such a neat idea. Uh, we, we came across it and thought this would really be cute for, for pups. Um, and it's a great way to recycle. Uh, if yeah. you have little onesies, if you've had babies outgrow their little onesies so quickly and we just got these, aren't they? This is the cutest <laughs> little things ever. <laughs> They're so adorable. So, um, yeah. So the the idea is to take a, a onesie, um, and uh, it can be washed and dried ahead of time. It doesn't have to be. It's it's totally up to you. It's fun to have a cute little saying on the on the front of it, right? That just makes it extra special. Um, you and could also to, oh, um, go ahead. If it were white, and so if you just had plain onesies that you were trying to recycle, you could create your own little saying. Just get oh, some fabric markers and create yeah. your own fun, cute little sayings that would work for your pups. So, because it's not always that easy for to find a onesie saying for a baby that'll work for a, for a, a dog. dog. So yeah. you could make yeah. your own, and especially if you're recycling, then you can just you know repurpose the the blank ones. Exactly. We found these on Amazon. They're super cute. They come in lots of different colors and styles. Um, I even found one on Amazon that, and I almost, I thought of you, Hillary, um, if you were making this for, for Leon, right? Uh, mm -hmm. I saw one that said, my sister's a basset hound. And I thought, oh. <laughs> wouldn't that be adorable? <laughs> so, I mean, there's all kinds of really cute ones out there um, that, that will work. And I think that's a great idea, Hillary. Just, you know, you can design your own, right? Yep. Um, you can put little patches. You could put, um, you could uh, iron on, you know, mm -hmm. like just all kinds of fun things to decorate it if you'd like. Um, but the idea is really just to grab one that'll sort of fit your pup, right? Um, the We've got a 12 month, again, these are 100% cotton. I washed and, and dried mine, so mine shrunk a little bit yep. uh, in the dryer. So Hillary's might look a little bit bigger, but they're the same size. And roughly the Six to nine month is kind of the dachshund size. We went up a size because there wasn't a nine month available in this print. And we weren't sure if the six month was going to be too small. Um, yeah. So we went a little little bit bigger than smaller. But basically just try and find one that's going to roughly fit your dog. So if, and if you don't know, um, this is Ginger's little s s fall sweater. And I just kind of put it along here. You can see there's a little bit extra width. Um, but the length is roughly about the right size, right? So that's yep. kind of a good good way to measure. Um, the other thing that you want to get is, uh, or keep an eye out for, is the split neck. Mm -hmm. These onesies are great because they've got that kind of that split neck, which will give your dog extra room because, you know, the sleeves are going to hang down in the, well, they're going to go the other way. They hang, they're yep. going to go down the front. Um, and a crew neck, I think, would just be a little too tight for, for your pup. And if they so, had snaps and things like that. So you yeah. want it kind of this easy, easy to get right. in and out of type of type of right. collar. That'll, so that'll, that'll help them. To be stretchy and easy to, to yeah. maneuver around. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. So basically you're just going to take some scissors and we're just going to cut off this rounded end here down at the bottom. Just go straight across and cut that off. And it doesn't have, you don't have to be perfect or draw a line ahead of time or anything like that. We're just cutting off that opening at the end. And now we got this cute little t-shirt. <laughs> and then we're going to turn it inside out. All right. And then now we're basically just going to make a little hem for it. So, you know, because otherwise this, 
the t-shirt material might fray or curl or all that kind of stuff. So we're going to just put a nice little hem on it. Um, so basically what you're going to do is just cut about an inch, inch and a half, doesn't matter, right up one side. And then you're going to do the same to the other side, just about an inch, inch and a half. Again, you're just eyeballing it. Okay, and then the next thing you're going to do is you're going to take that flap, right? And we're going to just hot glue that down. We're going to fold it over and then hot glue it down. So let's get my glue gun here. And you could use stitch witchery if you wanted for this portion too. Uh, mm -hmm. That would work. Yep. This is nice. Sorry for my squeaky gun. Uh, this is nice because it you know, it doesn't require an iron and yep. all that other stuff. It's Although sewing it or stitch witchery or any of that might make it you know easier or more longer lasting and all that good stuff. We're just doing quick and dirty today. All right. Yep. Here's that side. Here's my side. Now we're gonna flip it over and do the other. The other side. We're gonna just. Turn it up, kind of match the hem that you made on the other side. Kind of press it down just to give it a little bit of a crease, make it easy to glue. And I'm just doing my other, I did one half, now I'm doing the other half of the him. So there's my little hems. There you go. All right, and then you just turn it back inside out or right side, right side in. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is so cute. This is so cute. Isn't that adorable? That is just <laughs> precious. That is just the cutest thing ever. Like how quick and easy was that, right? Yeah, it's so simple. All right, so I'm going to try and wake my little sleeping giant over here. <laughs> Hi, cutie. This is Ginger. <laughs> Hi, sweetie. You were asleep, weren't you? All right, we're going to try this out. See how, see how it goes. All right, I've never done this before, so we'll see. You can slip your little paw through here. All right, there's one. There's the other one. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> there's her little store t shirt. <laughs> I just think that's so cute. That's He's so adorable. That's great. Oh my gosh. And it's the right size and everything, right? You know, and it fits just nicely. There's a lot of there's a lot of room here around the neck. Yeah. Um, that split neck really helps. Um, and oh my gosh, that is just the precious most precious thing ever. I can't wait to see yours on Leon. That'll be so cute. So we'll take some pictures and we'll post this up to our website with yep. links to everything you can get. Um I hope you had a lot of fun. This was a cute one today. Yeah. And if you guys end up like, it literally takes five minutes. If you guys end <laughs> up making some, we would love to see some pictures. So please oh, share those with us. We yes. would love to see how they turn out. Absolutely. And if you're looking for other kind of fun, crazy dog craft ideas, um, check out our playlist. We have a ton of different ideas down below. And also, um, if you know somebody that you think would enjoy these, please share that, like, subscribe, all of those things really help us out a ton if you do that. Yeah. So yeah, yeah, we would appreciate it. And I'll make it. one last little pitch. If you'd like a t-shirt, we're wearing some from our shop and Christmas has come, the holidays are coming. Be sure to order so that you get yours in time. These are yeah. really cute and make great, for, great gifts for dog lovers. And you get to wear a tee just like your pup wears <laughs> a fun little tee. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, everybody. Thanks, Hope everybody. you inspired you to have a lot of fun with your pups this weekend. Take care. Bye-bye.